Clarkson University Hill Campus experienced a power outage shortly after 9 p.m. on Monday, September 16, 2013. I really wasn't doing too much uh, up until the power went out. I was just sitting around in my room playing games, doing whatever. Like, as soon as it went out, I was, I mean, I was confused. I was like, went to my computer over here or something? That was the first thing I noticed. But then lights were off, everything in the hall was off. I realized, wow, power's completely gone. So I, I don't know, I was bored, I was walking around, I want to see how far it spread on campus. So I walked up to the student center. Well, I was actually in the basement of Donahue doing my laundry and it scared the crap out of me because the second that I shut the door to the dryer, the power went out. And guess what? They don't have any emergency lighting in that part. They do in the hallways, but not in that particular part of the cellar and it was scary. What I was doing personally was I was in my room trying to work on like actual work for once, which is really rare, because I had nothing better to do than just to work. And I started up the program, but then the lights started flickering, like just really slight at first. And then all of a sudden, and I was like thinking that's normal, I guess, because the lights they're just flickering. There may be like a fly up there or something, just like something getting in my eye. But then they started flickering like harder, and they just like almost like turned pretty much off and then on. And then there was this collective drop. And the university's incident command team was activated. I stopped by, I think it was maybe a couple of RAs or some people like that. They told us we don't want people going around outside the student center, so just stay inside the academic buildings for the time being. Told to put, go back into the student center. And uh, yeah, then we sat for like two hours. It was great. No, we weren't stuck inside. Like we stayed clear there because we saw like there was a lot of people there like we tried going to like the ERC because like there was this one section that actually had internet there and one of my buddies like had to send an email out like that was important so like we just waited around for that and then we just left because it was it was getting really busy because some people had to get homework done that was online and all of a sudden my RA came into the student center started shouting at everyone that nobody is allowed to leave the building the ground is charged University used the NY Alert system to keep faculty, students, and staff informed of the situation throughout the outage. Did, when did you get the text message about the power outage? When we already knew, or oh, pretty much everything there was right. to know about it. It was like, the power's out? Well, I don't think that they did a very good job informing the student body what was happening. We never really had any official reports. I mean, it was just RAs yelling over a bunch of people. I was never really reached. Personally, you didn't like, get one of the text messages or emails. I'm not set up for the text messages and emails. I mean, <laughs> power outage. This is all from a email that we received while doing an investigation of this from the media department of Clarkson, who handles the actual press releases.